fellow diamond painting addicts and welcome back to Diamond Painting Anonymous. I'm Daphne and I'm here today to unbox some goodies from the folks over at DP Clubs. So they contacted me and asked me if I would be willing to share some things with you. So I picked out a few things and I'm just going to jump in. So the first thing I got is another diamond painting pen because we all know you can never have too many pens. And I'll show you the pin in a minute, but I'll show you all the stuff that comes with it. So you get all of the tips. You get the straightener. You get the single placer tip. You get the angled tip. And then you get a three, a six, and a nine placer. So you get all the tips. And then look at this beauty. It's another one of those resin with the stuff inside of it. And these are all these pretty pink and red flowers. And I just thought this one was really pretty. So I, of course, probably won't use the plastic tips that came with it. I'll put in some metal or steel tips, but yeah, I just thought it was really pretty and I can add it to my collection. I have more room now because I got my uh, storage case for my pens. Uh, if you guys haven't seen that, I'll link to the unboxing up there. It's actually a case that I got on Amazon made for markers, but um, I use it to store my pens because I can't, I can't stop getting them. So uh, this pen was $7.79. So cute new pen. And then I got a couple of canvases. So let me open these and I will show you what I got looking ahead because it is now officially fall moving into winter even if it doesn't feel like it at my house <laughs> so ooh, right away this is one of those thinner canvases that is easier to roll up and to get to lay flat so love that we get our standard kit boat plate of wax pink pen and then we have our drills so and then you guys this one was so cute Look at this cute little gnome. I don't know why gnomes have suddenly become a thing, but in the last couple of years, everyone wants one. So uh, yeah, so I thought this one was super cute. It is a 30 by 30, so let's measure and see. It is basically 25 by, I'm gonna assume 25. Yes, little, little, a skosh shy of 25 by 25. So we do have a schematic on both sides, which is good. We have DMC codes, which I love. Always love it when they give me the DMC codes. And it is nice and sticky. So I don't see anything that looks like it would be difficult to diamond paint. No confusing B's and R's are next to each other, but one's green and one is orange. Um, I don't see anything else that I think looks confusing. So yeah, that looks good. All right, so let's look at our drills. Okay, let's look at our drills. Oops, they're stuck together. Okay, so. 22 colors in this one. So let's look at our colors. So we get a kind of dark blush pink, a red, kind of an olive green, a dark gray, and a light gray. And then like a, it's like a, a sage green and a lighter sage green, an orange, kind of a dark orange, a yellow, a light green, a kind of caramel color, a red, a brick red, and then are those all the same color? Two bags of this kind of peachy color, and then one bag of this slightly darker peach, kind of a caramel color, a dark brown, kind of a, a dusky rose. Ooh, that's like a slate blue. And then we have a brown, a yellow and two bags of white. So, you know, considering that the background is white, those two bags are not that full. That's not bad for um, 
the background colors and stuff. So yeah, that looks really good. Happy with that. Okay, let me figure out how this folds back up here. It's like an origami puzzle, I think, sometimes trying to get all these back in the in the plastic bags the way they came. It's stuck on itself. Oop. There's an escape drill there. Okay, so let me put this back in here. And this one is $5.39. So let me set that off to the side. And let's open this one. Now, this one is kind of the same theme, but a little bit different. And you'll see what I mean in just a second. Let's see if I get another. Now, this canvas is a little bit stiffer than the other one. I would say it's thinner than usual, but it's definitely more stiff than this one. So, same thing, standard kit, boat plate of wax, pink pen. And we have our drills here. And guys, look at this cutie pie. Now, a little bit different season because this one is uh, Christmas, winter, rather than... I guess it's not Christmas really, it's winter, but I just thought this was cute. Let me smooth out some of these wrinkles here so we can look at it a little bit better. Okay, there we go. All right, so this is a 30 by 30 as well. So let's measure. It is, yeah, same thing, just a skosh under 25 square. So, same thing, we do have uh, a schematic on both sides. This one only has 20 colors instead of 22. We do have the DMC codes on both sides, so that's always a plus. That's good, and actually it looks like we have the DMC codes on the bags of drills as well, so love it when they do that and I get them in both places. It's nice and sticky. And I'm kind of trying to look at the background here. Of course, there is quite a bit of white because not only is it the outside background here, but of course the snowman and then the gnome's beard and some of his little clothing has white. But I just thought it was really cute. So I don't see anything. It looks like they've done a really good job of kind of differentiating in the diff different colors uh, with different symbols. So yeah, all looks pretty clear, so that looks good. And let's look at our drills. Okay, so of course we have white. I'm expecting we'll have more than one bag, but yep, so two bags of white. And then let's look at our other colors. So we get this kind of berry red, a kind of pink, a light gray, a red, a purple, a dark gray, and a light gray, a caramel color, another red, a peachy color, a hunter green, that is a very dark brown, Ooh, that kind of watermelon color. Love that one. That's kind of a dark mauve. Very bright purple. Kind of a, I don't know, what is that? A cornflower periwinkle. Kind of a grayish blue. Another red. It's almost like that same watermelon color. A slightly darker purple. A very dark mauve. And again, then our two bags of white which actually, considering how much of the background and the snowman and everything is white, I would have expected more white than that in it. So I'm kind of pleasantly surprised that there isn't more than that. So let's figure out how this folds back up. It's like trying to figure out I think I spend more time trying to figure out how to fold these up and put them back in here than I do on anything else, which is kind of crazy. Sorry for all the crinkling, folks. And then, of course, they get stuck on each other. Okay, and then 
This one was also $5.39. So as always, I will put links in the description box down below so that you can check those out. Also in the description box below are links to my Facebook group. If you would join that, that would be awesome. And follow me over on Instagram. You can follow me at Diamond Painting Anonymous over there. So just to recap, we have this winter gnome from DP Clubs for $5.39. We have our fall pumpkin -y gnome uh, for $5.39 as well. And then we have our very cute pink and red flower diamond painting pen for $7.79. And again, as I said, I will put links in the description box down below so you can check these out for yourself or anything else that might catch your eye while you're there. Before you leave, don't forget to do all the things. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. That helps me out even more. And hit that bell notification icon so that you can be informed of future uploads. And as always, guys, thanks so much for watching.